हेलो एवरीबडी नमस्ते माई नेम इज एंजल राजगुरु एंड आई वेलकम यू टू डब्ल्यू एच डी सी टीम्स एंड आई एम गोइंग टू मेक वन हंड्रेड वीडियोज एट ड्रेसिंग टीन एज हसल्स एंड हाउ टू डील विद दैम एंड आई एम वेरी वेरी एक्साइटेड एज दिस इज द फर्स्ट वीडियो टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट समथिंग दैट आई स्ट्रगल थ्रू आउट माई टीन एज लाइफ एंड दैट इज हाउ टू ओवरकम एंग आई वॉज ऑलवेज अ वेरी एंग्री पर्सन माई फादर यूज टू कॉल मी अ फायर बॉल because i would just react to anything and everything and any time now unfortunately all of us have been unconsciously programmed to build this anger look around you everybody is getting angry parents are getting angry teachers are getting angry politicians are getting angry policemen are getting angry even the heroes in the films are getting angry superheroes are getting angry everybody is getting angry and projecting anger to get things done so it's pretty obvious that we all develop this anger Now it was in my late teenage that I realized that anger is actually making me weak it's not making me strong and in fact it's harming me it's harming my mindset it's harming my behavior it's harming my personality it's harming my efficiency it's harming my relations it's harming me it's delusional you think by getting angry you are controlling the situation but the truth be you are in fact losing out you're losing opportunities you're losing the situation you're losing self control you're losing people Trust me nothing destroys relationships more than anger you're literally scaring them off but with conscious efforts you can overcome anger and i am going to share with you how i did it but before going ahead if you find this video useful subscribe to our channel and do hit the bell icon the first thing is you have to lower your tone now i consciously started speaking in a lower tone whenever i would start a conversation i would make sure that i've toned down a little from my regular tone If you have a raised voice you are more likely to get angry and if you just tone down a little bit you will see the chances for you to react drop drastically it's as simple as higher your energies more hyper you get so it's like controlling your energy so you're less hyper and more stable so the next time when you have start an interaction just tone down a little and see the difference the second thing is listen through what i have observed is that something triggers us to get angry it could be a word it could be a sentence or the tone of the person or the person himself or something else that is going on in our mind so to break this impulse i started listening to the person fully i wouldn't speak until the person has completely finished saying for the first couple of times i found it little difficult but then it was magical I could feel that the impact of the triggers had reduced and I did not feel like getting angry anymore and that was a victory for me. Third point is do not give in. Even after consciously working on myself following the first two points I ended up getting angry and encountered a huge fight. Now this is the most sensitive and crucial moment. Do not get mad at yourself or blame yourself or curse yourself or shut yourself from others. It's all right. If 3 out of 5 times you got angry it's all right but 2 times you did not and that is huge so tell yourself it's all right and that you will do better the next time after practicing the first 3 steps i had become more confident and much happier and that's when i decided i need to take on something that i can practice every day so i started with meditation i cannot emphasize enough on the impact meditation has had on my life it has changed my life completely all you have to do is practice meditation for 10 minutes daily in the beginning start with a guided meditation i'm sharing some links in the description which will help you meditate every day do it for 21 days and then go on to do it for 90 days and you will see for yourself you have become much calmer much happier and you will see that you are full of energy now and in control of it fifth drinking water the next thing i did is that i started drinking more water every day i am sure all of you would have heard that when you get angry you should drink water to calm yourself and i started doing this deliberately by drinking more water every single day so all you have to do is increase the amount of water that you are drinking daily and whilst i used to drink water i would say to myself that the water is calming me and it really worked for me it really calmed me down so after you finish watching this video go ahead and drink a glass of water sixth is eating healthy i know as a teenager the most difficult thing to give up is junk and so i'm not asking you to give up junk but all i'm saying is add two meals of healthy food in your entire day two meals of your day 
where you are either eating fruit or salads or soups or anything that is healthy the kind of food you eat has a huge impact on the intensity of your thoughts and reactions you will see the difference for yourself that just by eating healthy food you will not be in a state of reaction all the time and that you would be much more balanced and calmer and the last but the most important one is laugh laugh more indulge in more humorous conversations than arguments choose comedy over drama crack jokes with your family laugh as often as you can and you would have changed as a person and people will like having you around i'm sure if you follow these steps within no time your anger would have vanished and you will feel much more powerful and peaceful and happier than ever in my next video i'm going to talk about how as a teenager you can learn to make independent decisions thank you so much for watching this video if you find it useful do like the video comment below and share it with your friends and also do subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon and stay updated thank you so much namaste